Hey, and what's going on, everybody? Welcome to an FTG Live series here in Emerald Valley map here. Another FDR uh, special map coming at you. We have got a brand new series for you here today, guys. Uh, welcome to the Full Till Sawmill. I got to set up a few little things about this, and then we're going to get into this. Uh, welcome to, and I'm going to introduce you to the FTG Contracting Incorporated crew. Uh, this is, I'm really excited about it. This has been something I've been working on here for the past couple of weeks. Uh, as you can see, we are at Emerald Valley, but as you can see, uh, as I actually sc scroll around here, we have got a very, very, very big, huge change on this map. We're going to kind of walk through this really, really quickly. We've got everything forestry production here uh, that we can possibly fit into a map. Um, so one of the things that I wanted to start with this map is I wanted to say, what can I do that's different that gives us something to log for? Even in PC, there's always something here that we just don't have. So the one thing I wanted to do was say, okay, let's find something. So we're going to showcase what we're going to do on this map. Let's put it this way. It's going to be freaking awesome, and I'm glad you guys are here. we got 20 here uh, that are here right now, and I'm sure we'll have some later. So welcome to all you guys. We'll get to you guys in chat here in just a second. Uh, we're going to make a really quick walk through here, and then we're going to get started, guys. It's going to be awesome. Uh, we'll be back with you here in exactly one minute. Don't go anywhere, guys. Hey, and what's going on, everybody? Welcome back here to an FTG Live series here. Big old full till sawmill uh, with the FTG Contracting Incorporated logging crew. Let's take a quick look here. I got two of my best buds here. These guys have been with me pretty much since the very beginning of full tilled gaming. Um, I'm actually not sure where they're at. Let's... Uh Anyway, uh, they're probably off doing work. At least they better be. But anyway, uh, I've got my buddy, Mr. Ryan here. You guys see him in chat. Uh, he's also back and forth. You guys there. I see uh, Mr. Raptor, Nick T. Welcome, you guys. Glad uh, that y'all came in and support. Appreciate that a lot. Uh, you guys, Mr. Ghost Rider here on the left, Mr. Ryan. Uh, that's who he is. So uh, welcome to you, Ryan and Mr. Chuck. You guys know those guys. They've been with me from the very beginning. So I'm really, really uh, appreciative that they could be here for uh, the, this big inaugural Full Tilt Salmo. So welcome, guys. Thank you. Awesome. Uh, so, okay. So here we go, guys. Uh, one thing that I've got here, we took it and completely modded this whole entire map. Uh, took it in, in uh, Giants Editor. We completely leveled out, did a lot of terrain work in this map. Uh, and we've set things up to really be a actually fully functioning lumber mill. So this is a production site for everything. Now, the whole idea behind the full till sawmill is that we can actually take all of this stuff and actually put it and actually produce every bit of materials that we're going to need, whether it's wood chips for fuel for oil that's going to go into anything else for these home sites and custom home sites all over the map. So we, have, so we take a look here at the map. We have 10 sites. Uh, now what we've done is pretty much pulled up four, uh, number five, number nine, and number 10. And I've got one out here that's a special surprise. That'll kind of be our finishing, uh, our finishing site. So we've got about five sites here that we're actually going to be uh, messing with. And We'll kind of showcase these different sites as the time comes, but we've uh, done, you know, concrete driveways all the way out to them. So we're actually going to be logging and actually clearing trees for the views on these places. It's not going to be started at the beginning of the map and we're just going to clear the map. We're actually going to start and we've got a set 
particular zone that we're going to actually log and clear all that out bring it here produce the lumber we've got storage for all the lumber so today's episode we are going to focus on starting our lumber at one of our home sites and we're actually going to pull all of that stuff back over here into these wood stacks and these are right off the mod hub so you can go there and grab these if you want to uh, but we're going to actually put them in here and these logs actually have to dry before we can cut them so the hope is that we'll be able to set all this stuff up and get everything set up here get all the logs inside of the wood stacks and those things can start drying so that way by our next episode we'll actually start functioning here with the sawmill as well as the plywood mills so we'll have lots of stuff going on uh, we'll be able to deliver all this stuff up all over the mountain to the different home sites we've got trucks we've got trailers rambo 145 mods in here we've got fdr mods in here we've got just a big old huge lumber operation so first things we did we just brand got a brand new hey thank you for that sub there zach valhorn van horn appreciate that uh and then we've got a d7 dozer over here that we're actually going to pull in so if you guys want to do that i'm going to catch up with chat i got a lot of guys in here i want to say hey to uh so we got a brand new d7 just came in today and they're actually going to pull this uh over there to the other side we've got a wood chip uh, pile that we're going to be starting over there in the very corner and that is going to allow us to be able to keep all that stuff up and out of the way and also be able to use that for production on uh, all of our other uh, plywood plus our wood chips that are going to be needed here to make our sawmills run so very 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 cool stuff so while they're doing that i'm going to kind of back up get out of their way uh, and then we'll start loading up a few things we'll get cracking here All right, there they go. So uh, welcome. I saw Raptor came in. So welcome to you. I saw uh, Mr. Michael Lee. Great to see you, man. Nick T. Great. GeForce Gaming. What is going on, Mr. Nathan Smithwick? Paladimo. No face cam. No, no face cam yet just because I have not completely got everything set up. Uh, I want to try to get that done and get into a, my new spot, but we're still we're still kind of in, I don't want to say we're in construction, but this is kind of like the most makeshift place I can actually possibly be doing this. So um, if you guys want to see what it look like, if it's just really bugging you, you want to say, hey, what's that you look like? Go check out that video down there. I did a um, nice little face cam reveal. All right, so I want to actually look here because I, I am not getting any sound. This is like so typical. All right, so well, let's, let's actually let's bump that just back just a little bit there. There we go. And I'll actually we'll, leave that on. There we go. All right, I think now we got, yeah, so Ryan's got that down there. So, yeah, now we're good there. Hey, what's up, Benson? Mr. Ryan, yeah, obviously with me. Zach, yes, thank you, buddy. Appreciate that. Glad you're uh, here. Welcome. Uh, what is up, Brandon? Brian, hope you're doing well. Goat guy, yes, been a while. It's been a while for me too, brother. Uh, it has been a while. I'm glad to be back doing it. I really enjoy doing this. So uh, I'm uh, also special, thankfully, to my wife. She's probably not watching. She is helping take care of the kids and pulling a little double duty so I can do this tonight. So uh, big old shout out to her. Now, who else we got? Zenin, what's up, man? How you doing? Good to see you. What are the mods? The server name? The password? <laughs> cater to your needs. I can do it, Nick. Uh, I'll cater to you anytime. Just a little bit. Uh, Nick T, man, he's the guy that puts a lot of the map stuff together for Raptor, so it's uh, especially uh, nice to see him in. He does a lot of work on there, and uh, they've been uh, very welcoming here of old FTG. So much appreciation to you guys. And uh, who has a uh, Paladimo? What's up, man? How was your five day? Yeah, it was good. Man, World Tester Five. What is up, Chad Miller? Good evening to you and Chris Gain. Hoy, how are you, man? Hope you guys are doing well. I'm gonna go and get to work, and uh, I'll try to keep up with chat. I'll try to catch up as much as I can, and uh, let get these guys in. So I'll uh, I'll hop in one of the uh, the other ergos we got here. We got some really nice equipment, man. We're gonna be we're gonna be uh, pulling in through this. It's gonna be really good. Put a lot of work into this map, so I hope you guys uh, enjoy you know, just all the, uh, you know, just, just enjoy having a storyline, you know. I mean, I know it's cheesy, you know, it's okay. I mean, it's farming sim after all, and it's a kind of a, it's not too cheesy, but it's uh, it's definitely cool to kind of give it a storyline and a reason to do what you're doing. Uh, and sometimes, you know, it can get lost in farm sim, and I think part of the uh, part of the fun in it too is also just be able, able, being able uh, to create a little something new. Uh, just creates like, oh man, this is cool. I mean, he's using these mods and, you know, putting something together that, uh, you know, makes sense. And it's not that I've done anything special besides the mods. I mean, anybody can go in here and do what I'm doing. 
so that's uh, that's nice. It's 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 good. So I hope I hope this idea spurs some creativity on your own. Uh, and I would uh, love to see you guys can catch me there. Full Tilt Gaming on Facebook. Also, you can send pics of your own uh, sawmills, your own logging operations. Go ahead and hit me up there on Twitter at Full Tilt. And obviously, if you want to keep up with this series, go ahead and hit me up there. Uh, get you a subscription there to the channel. And uh, we'll be doing this once a week. So it won't be something every day. So you don't have to worry about missing them every single night. You know, this is going to be a special thing, a weekend stream. We'll bring out the old full till sawmill. So I'll, I'll be excited to bring that uh, from week to week. That'll be nice. Oh, thank you, Nick. Appreciate that, man. Appreciate that a lot. Oh well, that's good, Zach. You know what, man? You gotta subscribe, and you've got to you gotta find out who you don't like. So I can uh, I can honestly I, I can side with that. So does this have does a lock? lock, 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 lock. Oh, hang on a minute. I might have to uh, zero out some audio there. Oh, oh, oh. I get a nasty echo. Okay, let's do that. All right, uh, go again, there, Chuck. Uh, is there a locking script on this trailer or no? Uh, yes, those are. Those are from Lambo there. Those are cryptic. Uh, so yes, those both have... What the, oh, sorry, sorry, sorry. Yes, the one you have does have locking. I'm not sure. I'll follow Ryan up in the other uh, Kenworth here. I'll let one of you guys lead the way. All right. <laughs> just shower thoughts. <laughs> yeah, uh, just, uh, hey, what's up, Lawrence Borden? How are you, man? Hope you're doing good. All right, take your left there, Ron. Oh, no, sorry. You're right. You're right. My bad. I told you wrong. I was looking at the map wrong. I made you look bad. I'm sorry. <laughs> EPS oh. was screwing up. Oh, man. Oh, All right. <laughs> All right, so uh, there's a few things here I'm gonna no I'll notice. You'll, you'll know pretty quick. I'll still be on dry level. We'll still have some little issues here with the map where the water plane's a little too high, so I need to lower that back down, and that will solve that. But anyway, here is uh, this is part of our gated community here. That's why I have two home sites off of this. Number four is right there. As you, uh, if you've ever seen this map, especially on PC, you know that all this is like a gravel. So we've gone and cemented everything. We've got grass going on all these back, so they are literally ready to rock and roll. And uh, we'll pull up here to a uh, house site number five. That's where we're going next. Nice, pretty drive through here. These people will really enjoy the houses that we'll be building for them. Uh, no donations menu. Uh, what you mean by no no donations? All right, here we go. So here is a nice log cabin that is being built here by the FTG contracting crew. Hey, what? Let me back this out of your way. Alrighty. I'll pull this off to the side. That way we can. Uh, you might be able to make the uh, to make the turn there. I'm just gonna get out. And just kind of. If you want to, if you guys want to go ahead and grab that, unload it, and uh, I'll just do a quick walk around here with what we've got going on. Kind of explain this, set this up. Now I won't be able to explain and set this up every single time we go in and do this, but uh, just especially for this first couple of intros here, that's about kind of just get everybody kind of caught up to speed. So we've uh, basically marked off exactly what we're going to do forestry wise and how we're going to lay out all the trees. So instead of just clearing everything off the cap of this mountain, we're just going to take everything that's going to allow them to be able to walk straight down uh, here into the lake. And this is Emerald Cove. So they'll be able to come right down here, go take them a nice dip, maybe catch them a catfish or whatever else is swimming in these nice crystal blue waters. Uh, so we'll be able to clear all this out and have a, a reason for what we're doing, or at least a reason uh, to get in here and chop some trees down. So we'll take all these trees, process them, and this will be some of the things that go back into building our house. So I hope that uh, a little bit of, uh, as we've used some of these nice little uh, tape off mods, uh, nice little forestry uh, mods here, just warning signs. We've used these to mark out exactly what area we're going to clear off. So everything here is going to be cleared off. We'll come back through. We'll plant grass around everything. It's going to be beautiful. It's going to be nice. These people ought to really, really, really like what they're going to be getting. So that'll that'll be that'll be nice. And I am going to move chat over just a little bit here so I can see what is going with you guys. To get some, uh, yeah. Uh, where do you donate? Um, why does 
Okay, hang on a minute. I gotta I gotta fix something here. Something's going wrong. Let me uh, let me fix my. Hmm. Yeah, there it is. Let me see. Let me see if I can fix this right here because this is a. Uh, I need my subs. <laughs> I don't know where all that went. Uh, the great thing about a live stream, if it does, I'll just. If it doesn't come through, then I will. Uh, yeah, good old YouTube, man. I tell you what, man, YouTube's really shows its colors sometimes. So I'm just gonna I'm gonna pull this off because uh, it's not working. So I'm somewhere around 1680. So yeah, there you go. All right, so there we go. Uh, uh, would yes. You bring an auto load trailer back up there. Yeah, you can. And uh, I guess we need. Uh, I'll come down to help you bring the other uh, Scorpion King down. Let's see. I'm just going to tab over. There's no sense in doing all that. There we go. Yeah, what's up, Zenda? I did move PC man. What is up, Addy? Hope you're doing well, buddy. Uh, it's always great to see you guys. All right, so here we go. We'll hop in this and we'll go ahead and take this one. Bring it back down to the, uh, to the place there. Oh, what's up, Jimmy? How you doing, buddy? Been a long time no see. Welcome to the stream. Hope you're doing good. Bob Ross, where do I donate? Oh man, uh, yeah, I should have I should have the links. If you go back to the main, if you go back to the main thing, there's a Streamlabs uh, thing in there. I, that's my bad. I forgot to do that. Uh, if, so if you go back to my main page there on YouTube, um, there's in the very top right corner of the cover art, there is a a, a little looks like a, a circle with a little face in it. Uh, and I've got PayPal and Streamlabs, either one, whichever one you feel more comfortable with, um, it'll accept both and it should, uh, there's a little shout out here on screen and I've got super chats as well. So super chats is just as easy to do. Um, and it's the little dollar sign there beside the emoticons there in the chat window. So if you want to do that one as well, uh, that one's totally fine as well. And I just about made the wrong turn there. Y'all didn't see that. What's up blue type. How you doing buddy? Well, just hold on, Zach. It may go on sale here if you're uh, if you check the uh, the stream the Steam stuff. They've been running summer sales like crazy, so you may be able to catch that in there. Hey, what's up, James? How are you doing, buddy? Nice. There, uh, appreciate that, Zen. Yeah, it's uh. It's good, man. Been uh, been saved up and you know made the investment, made the jump. Figured if I was going to do this, I needed to you know need to be somewhat legit about it. All right, so there's Chuck. So pull that off there. I'm gonna go ahead and get these trailers out of the way. And go ahead and get right. these uh, get these back down. Um, I think we've got enough actual uh, actual load in trailers up there, so we'll just uh, we'll go with those. Anything else I need to uh, bring up for you guys? Uh, I don't believe so. All right. We're going to have to replant their grass here. We tore it all up. That's yeah, all right. <laughs> Chuck wants some Starbucks. Thanks. That's <laughs> for you. Oh, I do zen it, man. Yeah, I was played. Uh, it's been a while, man. So welcome back to the stream, man. It's good, good to see you. I, I've I've really enjoyed seeing a lot of uh, new faces coming into PC. I mean, I met a lot of people, met a lot of really good people, and I've also uh, gotten to see a lot of my old faces from uh, from PS4 land. So it's always great, and and I always wanted this community to be one that could kind of uh, celebrate gaming together and not pit one against one another. So I refuse to allow that on, uh, you know, any of the stream stuff. So it's so nice to be able to do PC and be so welcoming to PS4 guys and Xbox guys and all the above. It's just, that was the whole original intent. So I uh, welcome everybody here that's here. It's, uh, it's really great to see you guys. You want these cut at six meters, right? Uh, yeah, let's do six for the one, and we can do eight for the other load. We just need to, you know, kind of do our best to keep them uh, separate. I did see that, Benson. It was pretty cool, man. I, I saw the update. I, I became a backer of theirs, uh, but it's I still need to do quite a bit of updating to the computer and uh, quite a bit of updating to um, my graphics card. i got to go up a few drivers, so it's kind of frustrating. I couldn't jump in there and play it tonight, but 
but hopefully by this next update they get us, I'll be able to put something up there. But uh, speaking of which, Con uh, Cowling Crops is actually coming to console. So you guys, once they get 1.0 done, the release for that done, they are going to bring it to console. So that is going to be a new farming game there for console. And how fitting is it that I just moved over to uh, logging here on uh, Emerald Valley and big console got a huge update today. They uh, managed to move in over to, actually, you know what? I want to take a truck over there. Why not? Brian, are you cutting yours at six or eight? Actually, I'm going to take the gator. Six. What is that? Six or eight? Six. Okay. So console got a big, huge update today. Uh, they got Smoky Mountain logging. Uh, I talked to a couple guys here on Twitter, which is actually really nice. If you guys want to, if you uh, do uh, any of the tweeting, you do anything on Facebook, go ahead and look me up there. I've got stuff scrolling up there. Uh, don't forget to throw up a subscription here. Keep up with what's going on here with me as well. Uh, but uh, connect with me on that. I, mean, I enjoy talking to guys on there. I met, uh, I think... Uh, the, the cow that goes, uh, the duck that goes moo, or the duck that says moo, whatever the his name was, uh, met him and found out he's actually from my home state about two hours away. So, you know, small world, another connection here in the gaming world. So that was uh, really cool to see. But anyway, uh, talking to Mr. Scott, y'all guys know him. He was one of our originals here from the original FTG uh, that started, um, you know, with the early YouTube stuff. And uh, he came out and told me that y'all had gotten a big map drop. So he said it was actually good. So I'll be uh, anxious actually to see some pics. You guys got pictures of your log setups, of your whatever you're doing. Please shoot those my way. I'd love to see them. Uh, and maybe you can feature some of those and share them on Twitter or what else you guys got going on. So I've also the PS4 community has been jumping right now. You guys have really, really, really been supporting the heck out of what's going on over there, Farm Sim for PS4. So. Uh, much appreciation you guys you guys have really been sharing out some really good pictures so i am got you got uh, probably a good handful of those we're going to be actually putting those together for some thumbnails and i'll be actually using those for myself so it's uh it's going to be good yeah there it is the duck goes moo <laughs> my bad <laughs> i knew i was gonna get it wrong but it's, it's, it's all good all right so what we got here you guys both got sixes going on i've got eights You've got eight sides, right, so he's got that. So let me go ahead and bring up some uh, stuff in here. We'll load these up. <laughs> it's a get log. <laughs> Come on now. <laughs> those are my those are my two boys there. Those are two from my uh, from my crew there on PS4. So always great to see Benson in here. I always enjoy talking to him and Michael as well. Uh, it's just uh, just cool, man. The the, the the guys that you meet in gaming so hey what's up Spence how are you man great to see you guys man appreciate that there's super chat there I'm not sure where my uh, where my my stuff went man um, I'm not sure YouTube and uh, looks like the other was kind of crapping out on me subs weren't showing up uh, So it's possible that it may not uh, roll the big thing across there. So it's kind of a it's kind of a shame I see there Chris Thanks for stopping in man I right, pull those last two. Uh, well, all right. Let me see if I can get those last two over there. Hang on a minute, there, Ryan. Let me get these last two up out of your way, and I'm gonna take a rod back to the uh, place here. All right, good enough there. We got the nice uh, T800 here. This is the uh, the Kenworth. Um, this is the auto load uh, six meter log here. This I think this is from Rambo 145. So you guys go down to Rambo145.com. You can download a bunch of great logging mods. He does really, really, really good work. All error free. So uh, really good stuff. Really good stuff. All right. So we'll take this out. We'll take this down to an oh, not that way. Better on this map. So I mean, I just about forgot where I was going. 
So we'll pull this all the way down to the uh, to the main area down here. We'll lay these things out to the side, and then uh, at some point here, neither on stream or right off, we'll go ahead and pull all of that stuff back, and uh, we'll put them on our log racks, and those ba those uh, bad boys will dry for the next little bit here. Uh, so we'll get them out situated here. We'll pull some of these smaller ones out. So we're just going to start here, and we'll just go ahead and unload. We'll pull these, these small ones out, get them laid off to the side here sometime, uh, and then we'll uh, get all of our normal size logs. We'll get all those set out too. So let's uh, let's go um, let's go right side, and let's go ahead and start an unload here. There we go. Some people probably would uh, would shudder at the fact I'm using an auto load, but just to keep things moving, I would normally spend all my time trying to lower everything up, trying to bring everything back around. But just just to uh, to kind of keep things going and keep the storyline moving, I wanna I wanna try to move as fast as I can. So yeah, I know Spence, man. Everyone's had a lot of problems with it. Um, the last stream I did was not too bad, but like this one, my my sub count wasn't working. Uh, evidently the subs uh, subs weren't working so I don't I doubt that uh, any of the super chat stuff come through so if you guys do sub go ahead and throw something down there please uh, introduce yourself here let me know who you are uh, I'll be glad to uh, give you a little shout out here on stream but then I'll take that shout out back if I find out you didn't sub that's how that works and now I've not heard about no woman there in uh, South Carolina man uh, yes I did get beta access there duck goes moo yeah, so I got uh, got those two. Plus, I went ahead and backed the project itself too. So, um, as soon as we get some updates for that, I will be pulling out some more Gold Rush. Unfortunately, that is just not a. Um, unfortunately, it's not a. Um, uh, what's the what's right? It's um, it's not gonna be a multiplayer game, which I'm I'm very kind of upset about. I'm hoping that they do bring it in, but you know. As of right now, it doesn't look like they're going to do it. This is going to cost too much money. But if they do meet their kickback, uh, their Kickstarter, if they do, oh, what the heck? Okay. If they do meet that, they are going to go ahead and pull in uh, new consoles. So the console stuff will be getting Gold Rush in some shape or form if they meet their kickback goals. So uh, Kickstarter goals, sorry, not kickback. So I would say if you're a console guy and saying, well, I don't want to really donate to it in case they don't come, uh, what I would suggest doing uh, let me get this to the left side. Uh, so what I would... All oh, those things aren't going to auto-load. I don't know why. All right. Let me get out of Ryan's way here. So what I would suggest doing is get up there and actually look and see is there is there a number that you want to see. If they get close to that and they need a they need a kind of like a final push, uh, then I would maybe jump in there at that point in time. So no multiplayer, man. I know, man. That's crazy. What's up, Farmer and Logger? How are you doing? Good to see you guys. Never mind, you're staying. Well, welcome uh, and uh, glad you're staying there, Chris. Actually, I'll probably turn this truck around and see if we can hit those logs up on the other side. So, Ryan and Chuck are masters at the Scorpion King. I am going to get Ryan to uh, send me some pictures of his setup. Ryan is running a... Uh, Ryan, are you still running your multi-joystick setup? Nice. So Ron's actually got the actual full Scorpion King setup. So he's running two full joysticks. Uh, got the foot. You got the foot pedals going too. Yep. <laughs> All right. So we'll have to get Ryan to uh, to shoot us some screenshots here, man. I'll share that so guys can check that out. All right. So let's see. We'll pull these bad boys up. Let's see. Here we go. We'll get those in there, and let's see if I can get these last two out of your way over here, Ryan. I don't know if I'm going to be close enough. Yeah, okay, so something's wrong with those. That's all right. All right, I'm going to go ahead and get these. Oh, you're going to shoot some of my way. All right, I'm going to pick these up. All right, left side. All right, so they're not going to go. Let me go ahead and deliver these off, reset that. Hey, what's up, Angela? How are you doing? 
Nice, man. 15K more for console. There you go, man. That's it. Well, I, you know, I, so I would say, it, you know, the one thing is, is look at it. And if they start getting close and they're like, hey, we've got a week left, any little bit helps, hey, throw five bucks, you know. Five bucks is not going to hurt, but you get enough five bucks together. It really puts a big old huge dent in it. So I don't know, maybe give out a whirl, see what's going on. And then uh, if it doesn't, then, you know, you're only out five dollars. And if they get really close and you feel like you want to throw a little bit more in there, you know, there's some more in there. I mean, it's I, some of the best stuff. We were talking about this shit the other night. Some of the best stuff that's coming out for gaming right now is kind of done by indie kind of guys, kind of guys that are just brand new on the scene. Uh, so it's really cool to see how they're uh, how they're bringing a lot of this stuff to the forefront. I mean, it's 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 impressive. I mean, there's no other game that we've ever seen that's done a pre-alpha like that, um, that's pulled a pre-alpha in that's almost complete. So that's awesome. So uh, thank you there, David. Appreciate that, man. Uh, Farmer and Logger, my TS well, actually is with uh, the rap, uh, rap Pack, so uh, I've got all the info down there. I'm generally on there, although I'm not tonight. I'm on another friend's uh, team speak. Um, but uh, I will be hopping over there here afterwards once we hit the live stream. So uh, be more than welcome to join in, talk with everybody over there. I'm usually usually on there, so uh, you feel free to come on and um, talk with me. I think um, I don't know about 400,000. I know I saw 80,000 was a goal they said was going to be very obtainable. Um, not sure if that's still the same. Uh, let's see if I can actually get. Let's see if he's will load up. If he's don't load up, then we got I got something going on here. Let's see what happens. All right, so we're still gonna have those like that one tree loads up on the wrong side, <laughs> so it could just stay over there. <laughs> What's up, Johnny? How are you, man? Good to see you, man. Johnny's one of the uh, man. He's one of the. Uh, I've got him up on my FTG United. Someone asked me the other day. Um, you know, who's that Johnny guy that's up there? Um, you know, I don't, I don't see him a lot. Johnny's actually out of the UK and does a lot of good streams. And, uh, one of the best organizers on farm sim I've ever seen. A guy can organize a farm like nobody's business. But, uh, Johnny was just really supportive of the channel, uh, here early on. Um, when I had, you know, 20, 30 subs, he came over and was very complimentary and, uh, and was extremely nice, especially coming from a PC player or a console player. Uh, so I put him up there and he's always been up there and I, I imagine at this point he'll never leave because he was just one of those early supporters. So, uh, and he always comes back in and he always stops in and says, Hey, when he can, cause I mean, it's like what, three or four in the morning over there for him. So special little shout out there to Mr. Johnny 7610. So great to see you, man. What's up, Cody? How are you, man? Catch up a little bit here with chat. There you go. Thank you there, Benson. Hey, what's up, Mr. Patrick Cummings? How are you, man? Good to see you. Yes, Gold Rush could be coming to console. That is correct. It is not going to be multiplayer, but it will be single player. But yes, it will. It's a bit icy. <laughs> All right there, Farmer and Logger. Sounds good, man. Just hop on there anytime. Uh, you can certainly uh, hit me up there. Look at these guys are doing an awesome job. So pretty much what we've got. Let me show you what I've got here as these guys are cutting in. Uh, yeah, well, that's the thing, guys. Uh, it's 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 in it's YouTube's doing its thing where it's not wanting to refresh and update with things that's going on here. So I will be sure I'll run me a donate thing here on my next stream if I get it squared away because my sub numbers weren't showing up. Nothing was sub, uh, showing up. So sometimes it happens. I, mean, I, just, I don't know what to say. Sometimes it happens and sometimes it, it just sucks. I don't know what else to tell you. I've done everything I can do to get it to work. Um, sometimes it does, especially on the weekends, man, when there's a big, huge influx of traffic, it does it every single time. So uh, pretty much what we've got here are these nice little, uh, these are, I, I think there's from Lambo. I think he put these out. Um, he's got some nice forestry equipment notices and warnings. So we actually use those to mark out what we're going to do. So we'll have a full, uh, pretty much a full 100 uh, degree viewing path here. Well, not 100. I mean, it's more like going to be like a 60 or a 70. So I have 60 or 70 degrees all the way out here into the Emerald Cove. And we'll uh, actually plant grass on all this. So it's going to be beautiful out here. It's going to be nice, pristine, have some nice shrubbery, some nice actual tall oak trees, something in there. Uh, and we'll actually have that going. Hey, what's up, Eric? Do I make money? Uh, yeah, I make some. Um, it's, it's not enough to consider this an actual... Uh, you know, payment uh, for a week's worth of work, but 
you know, it's fun. Uh, I would love at some point for it to be more than what it is. Um, and I, I'm certainly my wife would like to see that as well. <laughs> so, but other than that, uh, it's, it's fun, man. I, I keep it at the fun stage right now, no matter what I do in a stream or what I do in a week's worth of views for YouTube. Uh, it's, it's still fun. I enjoy the community aspect. So, well, I'll tell you what, Nick, you join us next week, man. I, I would, I'd, be, I'd be more than happy to let you come on and join us next week. Be glad to have you on, man. Noob Driver, what's up? 3.20 a.m. Man, it's early. What's going on, Cowboy 1981? How are you? Hope you're doing well. I was watching Ryan and these guys demolish some of these trees, so I think if you could, let me see if I can get these loaded up, Ryan, and just take a break for just a minute, and let me see if I can, um, I'm going to see if we can get that big trailer out, let's get some of these eight meters out here, because Chuck's going to start backing up on us. Yeah, I'm getting uh, backed up by myself here. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Hey, what's up, Bird? How are you, man? Man, it's good to see you guys, man. A lot, a lot of familiar faces tonight, so great to see you guys. That's, that's what I love about this, man. I, I've taken a break, and people are just excited to come back and say hey. Uh, you know, maybe you want to see Farm Sim. Maybe you just want to come say hey to me and say, hey, man, it's been a while. Uh, that's just great, man. I love it. Y'all don't ever y'all don't ever stop doing that. I, that's probably my favorite part of it, this whole entire experience. I just I really do enjoy the, uh, the, the, the community aspect of this. It's a lot of fun. Good, 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 man. Thank you there, T-Force. Appreciate it. All right, let's see if we get these loaded up. There we go. So I'll take these. These last three down here, or uh, something's up with them, so we might just have to, uh, you know, load them up manually and jump them in the chipper. Nice there, cowboy. Yeah, I'll tell you, man, Raptor's been extremely supportive of me, so uh, big shout-out to him and all those boys over there. They've been uh, super welcome. You guys ever wanted to... Have a nice little community to go play a multitude of games. It's a, it's a really good place to be. It's a really huge established community. Uh, good rules there to, to protect everybody and let, allow everyone to have fun. So if that's what your uh, if that's what your MO is, that's what you want. Um, so multitude of games over there. So stop in. I've got links there to the bottom uh, in the description. So if you guys want to be in there, I'm usually in there from day to day. So uh, if you guys want to stop in and say hey to me, please feel free to do so. And one of these days, once life just kind of slows down a little bit, uh, I plan on getting back and doing a little PS4 streams here. I've got a couple guys coming to request this week, so I will uh, try my best here to start making some of that stuff happen. It's just, you know, with a new baby and a lot of new changes here in the homestead, <laughs> just makes it tough. Oh man, AT and T. Yeah, I mean, there's always something going on, man. It's, I, I honestly, it's what I miss about the Mac. Uh, I didn't, never had to worry about that stuff, and now I'm always so flipping mindful about it. I'm like, oh my gosh, man, come on, this is another virus. I'm like, whoa, there, Mister, this might be a bad download. I'm like, but I'm downloading my phone bill. <laughs> <laughs> Okay, I guess I can't say it. I know. I just wanted my PDF of my phone bill, man. When they contact you and ask you why you didn't pay your phone bill, just tell them. <laughs> my computer said it was a virus. <laughs> They'll understand. <laughs> Sorry. Sorry. My bad. Hey, what's up, RC? Good to see you guys. Yeah, I'm going to come back and do a, a PS4. I always said I would, so I'm not going to back down on that promise. Um, I said I'd do it, so I'm, I'm definitely going to. Let's see if we can... Uh-oh. Uh oh, it's that same log. I wonder if there's something up with that tree. There, Ryan is just muscling it in there. So we got Ryan the lumberjack over here. Look at him. He just picked the whole entire tree up. Oh, and he still missed. <laughs> I'd have to get one of the Volvos up here. Yeah, you know, I wonder if I wonder if there's something on with that tree. Yeah, and the problem is there's a ton of them up here. Oh, and I, I'm, 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 yeah, I'm sure. Yeah, look, oh, some of them, y'all, yeah, the regular ones are coming up. All the modded ones aren't. <laughs> of course. That yeah, would have been good. I, I could have maybe tested that before we came up here and did all this. <laughs> That's all right though. 
Uh, I tell you what, let's do this. Uh, let's have let's have you, Chuck. Go ahead and stop where you're doing. Uh, let's get all these cleared out of the way. Uh, we can do this. Make a last uh, maybe maybe one or two loads down here. I'm gonna go grab the Volvo. Um, I'll grab the Volvo loader and we'll pull start pulling some of this stuff up. I'll Whoa. park the Scorpion King right here so you can push against it. Alright, sounds good. The Volvo. That's how we get scratches in it. Ah. <laughs> Use the equipment. Alright, what's uh bird? What am I doing ATS? I will probably do an ATS here. Um I'm waiting on my steering wheel and pedals. I got my shifter and uh, my SKRS topper that makes it turns it into an 18 speed is coming shortly. Uh, they have not sent me a definitive date on that, so uh, that one will just kind of come when it comes. But uh, as for the other ones, they're supposed to be here Monday. So possibly a little ETS with Pro Mods, flipping awesome. So maybe that one and maybe ATS. Maybe we can run a couple of streams next week of that. So maybe some come drive alongs there if you're on PC and you got Truckers MP. Uh, you could be uh, feel free to join along there with the convoy. We'll we'll do us a couple of deliveries. Um, maybe get Chuck and Ryan there to maybe join us next week to see if we can't do some of that. Yeah, I gotta download Truckers MP first. Okay. Oh, I know this is gonna be a little weird because this is definitely different. My my last setup's a little different, so we'll see what we can get. Now this thing, you guys, so this is a little bit overkill, but this thing is so much better. Uh, then the, uh, oh, you know what? Let's go ahead and get some of these small ones out of the way. See any of these little, uh, like any of these little, these little toppers. Let's just pull them out. I'm going to get them off to the side because they're going to do the create, uh, a havoc force. That's interesting that those, those trees there do not have the same characteristics as the other ones. I mean, I would feel a tree's a tree. All right, let's see what let's see what this thing can do. This thing's got a ton of power. Uh, it's absolutely fantastic, but uh, still got the regular log forks on it. Unfortunately, I just don't have, you know. But it doesn't have really any kind of worry. Now that's not gonna work either. Here, let me try and pull this one out. Yeah, go and get the get, get the big one out there, cause that one's just the one that's. Or you can push it back in. I've I've go ahead and lowered up there. There you go. That I mean, works. Yeah, I mean, heck, if I can, if I can just get those up to the trailer at this point, I'll be, I'll be good. We'll have to see. Hopefully, the the unload works, uh, you know, works okay. Yeah, that's kind of strange. That I did that. Yeah, it is. All right, so come on, come on. Yeah, those those things are a little bit off there. Now it's probably that's think that's something that's out of the uh, probably tree that's out of the FDR custom. They've got some birch in here. I know I've seen some birch trees and I saw a few other things. So uh, we can definitely out of this pile at least pull. Um, oh come on now! I had the whole pile and only got like five out of there. See, the weird thing is, is it didn't do this to us before when we logged up on site 10 yeah we use auto load up there yeah it's true what do they have these I wonder if they have these trees up there I don't oh, think I don't these know. birch ones I don't think they have a problem but these other ones that are a little bit lower down I'm not exactly yeah. sure if they uh, give problems or not well you can take this one up there let's see uh, what they do just pull up we'll just pull them off to a different side and uh, we'll see what they do and how they auto load if they auto load at all yeah All right, we catch up a little bit here with chat. So, uh, oh, Spencer's finally on the PS4. <laughs> finally on the PS4. I hear you, man. Hey, go ahead, Cody. What's your question, man? Um, play some more Gold Rush. Yeah, we're trying to get some Gold Rush when they get an update. Uh, I kind of played all that I could play. I mean, the only thing I've really got left to do is just 
Only thing I got left to do is just like dig a really big hole. That's that's about all I can do left that that it hasn't already been done. So um, I'm gonna tab down here and we'll see what he'll where when he comes back in. Oh yeah, I already got Trucker's MP up. It's all running, bird. It's all ready to rock and roll. <laughs> Give me the map, Giant's Island. <laughs> yeah, nah, I don't think so. Hey, what's up? Is that Kimoni? Kimoni Hall? Welcome. Cody, I threw you a little shout out. I may have missed you there, so uh, just wait on. Uh, there comes Chuck. Oh. I don't like O's, man. You look like you're hanging off the side there. No, 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 no. Not nearly as bad. I got a little to the side, and a tree that one of the logs that were sticking out on the side it hooked on another tree and stopped me. Gotcha, gotcha. Right, so Chuck's going to bring this one up. We're going to unload here. Um, actually, let's just move this down just a little bit. So if you want to, just pull it over here about where I'm at. Yep. And then we'll, uh, you can unload yep. which, whichever side makes uh, sense to How you. How do you want me to do it? Do you want me... You could just make a turn. Yeah, you can just make a turn right here and, and pull back out. And then just, uh, you go left, right or left side. It doesn't matter. Because we're going we're gonna to eventually pull these things up anyway and put these in a log stack. So this is just really a good stage in area. So we've got plenty of room uh, to let everything out. So uh, we'll see. I've also got a couple of other trailers that we may try. So if these are giving us problems, we've got a couple of others here that I can try just in case these something's wrong with them. So it looks like they work. They just they just load really far to the right. I'm not exactly sure why that is. So interesting. Um, I've got a I've got an idea fix for that. Uh, it's gonna take a little bit of finagling in two trailers, but we can still do it. Let's I tell you what for right now since we got the space, let's go ahead and cut everything at six. I'll at go ahead. Six? And, yeah, six meters. Oh oh okay. So do you not want this truck back up there? Nah, don't bring it. Okay. Oh my gosh, there we go. What's up, Trippy Brian? How are you, Brian? Uh, yes, World of Trucks is up. Man, you can find me there. FT Gaming is on there. So if, if you're ever looking on there, I'm usually, I am usually I usually do Truckers MP with uh, most of the ATS stuff. I don't do it too much with the ETS because I'm using the Pro Mods. And I love those. So I'm actually enjoying just a little bit of single player on that. So uh, it's up to you, man. Come on, whether or not you should subscribe. If you enjoy the content, come on and join us. Uh, it's going to be a brand new series here. Uh, once on the week here. And then we'll be streaming a lot of other stuff here. Uh, getting closer and closer to X-Plane. Uh, that's, that's ever so uh, coming along here pretty nicely. And we'll have ETS, ATS coming into the frame as well. So we've got lots of, uh, lots of additions coming in. So that's, uh, I'll leave that decision up to you, buddy. Comes right in the gator. I love that little thing. It's awesome. All right, so I'll let Ryan go ahead and hop in there. We'll tell you what, let's just go ahead. We'll grab everything else. We'll grab all the regular trees, uh, at least what we've got on those. We'll go ahead and grab those, and we'll get them up here as well, and we'll just chunk these off. Even if we have to, we can always save those trees, push them off to the side, and uh, we can bring a chipper up here and go and make some chips out of those trees if we have to. So either way, I'm, I'm okay on. Uh, no, I'm not there, Farmer. Uh, we're just on on my own personal uh, personal server. Eventually, at some point, we'll have some type of an FTG uh, dedicated server up, but uh, it won't be today. Here you go, Chuck. Go ahead and hop in if you want to. All right. I'll uh, just start uh, if you can. Maybe get in there beside uh, Ryan, and y'all can just pull things in in the middle, and uh, see if we can get both of these uh, get both these trucks rolling in here. I like to get uh, at least one little section off there, kind of cut off and ready to roll. Um, I kind of wonder if some of those trees, I wonder if they're up on top of the mountain or if that's something that's on the bottom. Uh, how many hours? Um, I own the Steam version. I've only got like 160 hours on it. Um, a lot of that has just been testing. I mean... Honestly, I have not even cut a tree on this map besides the very first full tilled sawmill. Uh, since this is kind of the remake, um, I've, all I've been doing is is editing, modding, and testing. That's all I've done. 
So we'll let these guys go ahead and uh, bring some of this stuff in. So we'll get another some nice little uh, another six meter stack going on here. Now a lot of these trees right here I can see. Now I'll tell you what, if you guys cannot, okay, the one Ryan got right there, that is a new one. So that is one of the, I think that's the modded tree, yeah. So if y'all see those, leave those in maybe if we can, try to leave them. Um, and then we'll just try to pick up all the regular ones, yeah, like what you've got here. Um, they're, they're the ones that have the funky tops on them. So if we could just leave them off to the side and we'll cut those up and we'll, uh, we'll, uh, we'll chip them up or we'll do something with, even if we haul them out as one big tree. And that way we won't have to deal with the auto loot issue of them being all up in the middle of everybody's uh, business up going on down here. So, oh man, thinking total, ah, I have no idea, man. I really have no idea. I would like to think maybe, uh, I wouldn't even begin to. I wouldn't even know to where to begin to even tell you. Now, like I said, a lot of it there was probably a good bit there, and the first part was uh, um, just resetting here, uh, resetting the event here. There it is. There we go. Um, so yeah, so I mean, I, I would say probably seven or eight hundred, maybe maybe more, maybe less. I mean, I played a lot of farm sim. Not gonna lie. I played a lot in 15, probably played more in 15 than I did in 17. Um, but uh, uh, most of 17, especially PC-wise, has been uh, testing testing all these mods to see if they work. So it's not actually been like gameplay, like what I'm actually doing now. This is kind of like the first time in like weeks that I've actually sat down and done this. Sorry, Chuck, when you do that one, I'm just going to kind of... I'm going to... Oops, I'm going to take your place there, and uh, we'll load up, load up some of this there on the... On that side. What's going on, Caden? Great to see you in a lot of new faces in, so welcome to all you guys. Don't forget if you guys do Twitter, if you do Facebook, Steam community stuff, got all that stuff running there on the left. So feel free. Uh, to uh, to hit me up on all that. Uh, yeah, I, I'm a little bit mindful of just friends because I know they'll fill up pretty quick. Uh, so don't take that personally. I just don't, you know, just randomly friend a bunch of guys that I don't really know. So if uh, if I wind up coming to get to know you here in the chats and uh, seem like a cool guy to talk to and you want to be friends on Steam, I have no problem with that. I guess do that. Yeah, so all these don't have a they don't have a problem, man. You just got to be close enough to uh, got to be close enough to to get them all up here on the trailer with you. All right, maybe maybe a couple more. There we go. It's good. Thank you. Get out of y'all's way. Hey, what's up, Eli? Yeah, man. Uh, Mr. Mike, you guys know him as Triple M or Eminem. I'll call him Eminem sometimes. Uh, he's doing pretty good. He had a heart cath um, a couple weeks ago, and he said everything's going well. Uh, he was actually in a stress test when we last got him. So, uh, but as far as I know, he's doing well. Um, and uh, he just told me to uh, send you guys his regards that he really hopes he can make it in the stream here soon. Um, but, uh, you know, health and all that other stuff, you know, kind of plays a big part. So he's hoping he can get back in. So he's um, he's definitely one of the good ones. I've enjoyed talking with Mike, and he's one that I've connected with on Twitter. So if you guys want to do that, go ahead, subscribe to the channel, keep up here, especially with Full Tilt Sawmill coming at you. Uh, you guys want to know what this is about, especially if you're just jumping in here uh, towards the end, go ahead and uh, read down the description. I've got a full kind of a little uh, synopsis here of what this is, what I'm doing, what we're, what we're actually working for out here. Uh, and as well as you can always go back to the very beginning of the video, and I've got a few other things there of what we're doing here with sawmills. So... We'll unload this all over here. I do feel like I'm cheating in a way. I'm not going to lie. I'm a little bit of a naturalist when it comes to my logging. It is a little bit... Uh... There's auto load in real life, didn't you know? <laughs> yeah, man. <laughs> it's called it does somebody else does it instead of you. <laughs> exactly. <laughs> Um, Kate, no, I'm not exactly sure if I know you from there. 
but welcome to you. Glad you glad you jumped in for a hot quick sec. All right. So basically, we are probably more than halfway done here. Uh, now we're not going to constantly stay here. What we'll do is we'll continue to keep going here as these guys chop. We'll get them to uh, get us some more loads of trees out. We'll get some more stuff loaded up. Uh, and we're uh, getting ready to get close down to the actual water down here. So we'll be able to knock the rest of this out pretty quick uh, once we get some things going here. So you guys are doing a fantastic job. We'll get some of these uh, these other modded trees out of the way. I'm not sure uh, what the what the problem on those is. I could do something right now and hit a button that, that would tell us, but I'm not going to because I don't want it to crash the game. <laughs> I feel like we put too much work into it now. Yeah, that would be a bummer. That's no, all good, Caden. That's no, all good. I never can tell you asked me, so that's, that's fine. Hey, Jamie, bring some Westfield augers to North Carolina. Awesome. Well, hey, man, if you're ever in North Carolina, man, shoot me a message, man. Depending on where you're uh, bringing them to. Um, I mean, I'm pretty much right in the center of the state. Um, I love it, man. Ryan's just the Ryan's the kind of he's got to have Ryan on the farm with you, man. The guy can pick up a freaking tree. <laughs> oh man. Oh Chuck, it was it was going so well. <laughs> that one just flipped completely over. <laughs> uh, All right, uh, for you, uh, let, let, me, let me. I'm gonna pull in right here, Ryan, right behind you. So uh, just watch what you're going in reverse there. You're gonna grab some of these out of the way. Oh, this is good, Eli. Thanks for asking, man. Baby's doing well. Mama's doing well. Everybody's doing good. If you guys want to know a, uh, if you ever want to know a mod that I'm using, or you want to know anything that's going on here, please don't don't uh, feel free to ask. Um, you know, if it's like repetitive, dumb questions, I'm not going to answer them. But uh, especially if it's uh, if you've got something on here and you say, hey, where, where's that mod? I've been looking for something like that. You know, where'd you grab that one? Everything that I've grabbed, none of it is actually special and given to me uh, specially. Now, the map is all me. You will not be able to download this map anywhere. Uh, and I do not know that I'm going to, like, you know, just pass it out. Um, I haven't really decided on anything like that so far. Um, but if there's anything you guys want to see, feel free to throw up a question, man. All right. All right. We'll make us a couple more loads here, and then uh, do want to let's let's take a drive through uh, before we end this, guys. I'm gonna take a drive through here, show them the rest of the map. Uh, we'll just hop in the old Chevys up there, and uh, we'll take them through some of the home sites we'll be working on. We'll save one of the surprises uh, for the end. We've got kind of working on that one periodically, so that's gonna be exciting. Um, yes, uh, so Paladima, that is the creator tools. Um, if you basically, if you hit G on the keyboard, it gives you these three muscles mode, help, creative money, walking speeds, heads up display. So I can, uh, I can clear the whole entire HUD, like for screenshot modes. Uh, so if you guys like doing that kind of stuff, you know, if you want to know, Hey, how do you get a clean full res image? That's how you do it. Uh, it also allows you to kind of, uh, elevate out of the ground. You can't do it inside of a vehicle, but once you get out, you can actually, Elevate yourself, which is how I started the stream off. Um, so it's got some pretty cool stuff in it. What in the world? All right, so we'll pull up here and we'll go ahead and unload this last. Go get a couple more in here. Uh, let's see. Just kind of sift out a little bit there. Um, how would you get that mod? Uh, well, I mean, honestly, I mean, uh, just shoot me an email or something, uh, full tilt farming at Gmail. And I mean, I'll just, I'll just, I'll zip it to you. I'm not exactly sure. Um, those creator tools, I want to say, I'm trying to think where I got them. Um, 
I know a lot of the other YouTubers use creator tools just because it allows you to completely hide the HUD. It hides all the names of the people on the map. So on that front, it's really good. Um, but uh, yeah, just shoot me an email, man. I'll, 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 I'll shoot it to you. It's not, uh, it's not like a private mod or anything, so... I think it's been around for a while too, so you, you would pretty much have to go deep inside those page sets on those mod pages to actually figure out and find out where it's at. So, uh, No, I don't have Discord there, Farmer. I, I use uh, TeamSpeak, and uh, I'm in TeamSpeak there with Rat Pack all the time, so um, it's good enough for me. It's free. It works. It's established, uh, especially with them, and um, so that's just what that's just what I use. I certainly will, Eli. All right, so let's go ahead. Uh, yeah, YouTube, yeah, I'm, YouTube message will be fine, man. Just, uh, just shoot me, uh, shoot me something that I can send back an email I can send it back to. And I'll zip it up and shoot it your way, man. It's really good, uh, you know, especially for the tree stuff. Is if you got these stubborn trees and you don't have to cut them up in a million pieces to get them through, that's always nice. All right, let me get this last one. So welcome. We see the uh, numbers here going back up. So, uh, welcome, guys. All that are uh, here, the guys that are new. Uh, just to give you a little 411 here, we got a lot of stuff going on here with the channel. So welcome to, first off, the Full Tilt Sawmill. Uh, this is going to be a weekly series we're going to start here. So we are contractors here with the FTG Contracting uh, Incorporated, and we will be delivering uh, uh, actual lumber milled sawmill products from plywood to actual milled pallets to wood chips for heating and all the other assortment of stuff that we have here at our disposal with farm sim but also delivering these to custom home sites here in a custom modded map that's edited by myself so uh, everything you see here in the map does not actually look this way uh, you know from its default state so if you ever been on Emerald Valley and you're like well, hey that doesn't look like the Emerald Valley I have well there's a reason uh, so I've done all this especially for this series. So I hope you enjoy it. Uh, whoops. I don't know where that came through. Let me actually stop that. Stop. Stop. There we go. All right. Now we're good. Uh, so I hope you guys enjoy it. So uh, consider throwing up a subscribe here. Uh, much appreciated. Don't forget you can also connect with me there on Full Tilt on uh, Twitter and as well on Facebook. Uh, and I'm actually active on both. So if you guys ever want to shoot screenshots my way, uh, please feel free to. And also I've got uh, PS4 community, Full Tilt Gaming there as well. So if you get out of the PS4 communities, uh, we've got a lot of really great guys in there. Always looking for help, always offering help, which is great to see. Always enjoy seeing guys uh, offering to help somebody else that maybe is uh, not as well versed in farm sim as they are. So much appreciation to you guys. You know who you are. I always say something to you guys when y'all uh, do that. So I appreciate it a lot. Ryan, can you cut one of these trees out in front of me? <laughs> this tree literally <laughs> fell in a spot as big as the tree. <laughs> that was like... yeah, get some of this cleaned up here on those guys while they're cutting. Alright, so there's that. So basically Creator Tools also allows you to do this. So I can roll the mouse wheel up. And uh, we can take a, you kind of get a good, this is actually really cool, guys. I'm getting like a, uh, yeah, let me let me hide some stuff here. We'll, we'll, we'll grab some video from this. Maybe we can use it. So we get a nice, good aerial view here of the actual, uh, of the actual site. This is actually really cool, man. Let me zip up just a little bit more. So as you can see, uh, there I've got maybe, what, 15 more trees at max? Maybe 15 more that they'll be able to get cleared out here. We'll grind all these stumps up. And uh, we'll make sure that all the grass is nice and plush all the way out to the ends there. And some nice big trees out here. And uh, they'll just bring them all the way out to the Emerald Cove. And nice good feeder creek here that comes right out of the top of the mountain there. All the way back down in here. And all this bleeds into the Dakotan Lake. So very cool stuff. I love this map. This is one of the better ones I think FDR did. Uh, like I said earlier, console just got Smoky Mountain today, which was really cool. I know you guys were super excited to see that, especially if you're a big logging fanatic like I am when it comes to this. So 
Uh, it was great to see that. I'm, I'm really glad that FDR stayed with it. They've really been trying to get some good stuff to console. I know they've tried getting their uh, processors and their fullers and all the rest of the stuff they've been trying to do. So it's really good to see them get something in there. So I hope it works well for you guys. Hey, what's up, Kevin Castaneda? Hope you're doing well, man. Great to see you guys. YouTube is actually probably not really. I'm going to say YouTube is not working tonight. Uh, subs seem to crap out on me. Uh, PayPal notifications, Streamlab notifications all crapped out. So uh, if you guys do sub, go ahead, throw up something here. Let me know that you did. And, and I'll, I'll throw you a little quick shout out today. Of course, they, they grouped a bunch of these trees that we don't want to cut down right next to each other. Oh, nah. I have to find out what those trees are and find out if there's something on why those trees will not um, auto load. That's interesting. I mean, you know, to me, a tree's a tree. They just change the texturing of them. That that would be my well, assumption. Do you want me to just cut them down and put them in the eight, eight meter pile? Um, yeah, I guess would be fine. Um, if they're easier to go over there, we'll 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 definitely we'll clean them up. Get these last ones here. If I get one of you guys to uh, come down and drive one of these trucks over, um, these last couple, and if you want to, uh, tell you what, let's do this. Um, why don't you guys grab a couple more? If you want to throw a few more here in the pile, let's make one more run down to the sawmill, and let's hop in the trucks. Let's take a drive here. Let's showcase the map out a little bit here for everybody, give you a last little taste here of what's to come uh, here with the full till sawmill. we got a lot of stuff coming. I want to kind of just drive real quick. Uh, through the farm, not through the farm, but through the yard up there, logging yard. Uh, we'll kind of showcase what we've got, some of the mods we've got, and then we'll take a quick trip down there. And uh, we'll go up to 10 because we actually logged 10 last time. So I want to show you what has been done up there on 10. Uh, and we've done a little bit of bridge construction and everything going up there. So it's a lot of cool stuff. So if one of you guys want to, uh, once you get your pile done, unless I'm back, uh, I'll start taking these, I'll deliver these, and then we'll take a ride over there. Does that sound good? Sweet. Well, it's going for a little bit longer. Uh, the the point with this uh, too, just just guys that may be watching in later on, uh, the point with this too is to give you a nice watchable stream um, that uh, that takes about an hour, and you you know guys can come back, they can rewatch it, they can catch up with the series, and it's no more like watching a TV show. Um, so that that would be my that'd be my end goal with it. There's gonna be a lot more streaming coming up too, uh, so I have a lot more of opportunities. This has been really really busy these past couple of weeks. So you know we just gave birth, so we're just really trying to we're just really trying to get our hands and, and heads wrapped around all of that. So, um, but it's 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 going to happen. We're slowly but surely getting there. So it's 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 good. It's all good. All right. So let's go ahead and right side. Let's start the unload here. I got a couple of tools here that we're going to use to uh, to get these, so we may actually run another episode here uh, of getting all of these up, getting them stacked up here on their actual logging, uh, the wood stacks, uh, and then starting to get those from the wood stacks over into the piles. As you can see, we've got tons of lumber here. Just taking a quick drive, a quick ride pass here. It's really cool. I'm, I'm excited about this. It's I feel like it's been a long time coming, so... Uh, Farmer Lager, I'm not sure what you mean in game there. Uh, I'm sure that's with your last comment, but I don't really have time to, to roll back there and comment. Someone could just grab what he said earlier. I, I'd much appreciate it. Just copy and paste it right down there for me. Uh, thanks, Benson. I will certainly do that. I've been trying to uh, give me a couple different templates up now that I'm going to stream a couple different games. So, yeah, uh, I'm, I'll actually sit right here off to the minute here. I'll, I'll write myself a note there and not forget that. Oh, you reminded me that last time and I didn't do it. So, <laughs> I'll try to do that this time. <laughs> Uh, will I be streaming tomorrow? Oh, yes, I will be, but I will not be by myself. Uh, well, I should be, I think, rolling with Rat Pack tomorrow. We're, I've got a little special surprise tomorrow with farming uh, Sim. So tomorrow, I think 12 o'clock. We usually get started up sometime 12, 1230. Uh, actually, that's his time. So it's 1 o'clock East Coast and then all the way back three hours on the West Coast or uh, five hours ahead if you're on the uh, Europe side. 
Um, so yeah, uh, so I'll be actually there. So come stop by, say hey, FTG sent me. Uh, throw a big shout out there and uh, see if we can't get it. I'll try to keep up with chat too and kind of uh, hit you guys back if I can. But I think we're going to do a little farming tomorrow, so hopefully I can join up there with them. So you can uh, feel free to come check that out. All right, let's see right side, and we're going to start us a little unload here. Whoops, 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 whoops. Didn't get up that close enough. This sport's actually kind of the, it's ironic, this is kind of the boring part to me. No, the fun part is actually getting all these back up and then actually load them into the wood stacks. Hey, there's a nice comment. Can I give you a link to download this game? Nope, not on stream. <laughs> oh, man. All right, guys, let's do uh, let's do those last two truckloads and uh, let's call that uh, let's call it that for this one for right now, and then we'll finish up here after a minute. Okay. These guys have just been patiently watching me ride this road back and forth. <laughs> Canada Day. All right, man. You got Canada Day tomorrow. The July 4th here is coming up on Tuesday. There'll be a lot of July 4th festivities this weekend, so you guys make sure you're safe. Have fun, but always be safe. All right, so let's go ahead and get, uh, let's get as many of these as I can. Oops. Well, what's going on, Cannon? How are you? I see, guys. Welcome to anybody here that is brand new into the stream. So, welcome to the Full Tilt Sawmill. This will be a new uh, series that we'll be pulling up here, uh, new once a week. So, it'll be a new episode every week. So, uh, keep track of it. You can actually, I will put it up like I did this past week. I'll put it up like a, uh, or this past stream. I did like a, a, oh shoot. I did like a day in advance. Just kind of give you guys a, a heads up. So if you didn't, you can actually just put yourself an alert for just that one episode. Uh, just in case you don't want to see everything else that's coming out here with FTG and be notified every time I go live. You can actually do that. And it's actually a really good way to kind of keep up with something that you're really interested in. Uh, but that, that doesn't completely just uh, spam your phone. Because I, I, I even at some points can get aggravated with that. And it's nobody's fault. It's just aggravating. I already get enough notifications on the phone. I don't need any more. Oh, these are the trees that don't auto load. Yeah, so basically what we need to do is I need to be where you're at, um, facing the other way. And I think if I auto load it, it will land in your trailer. You get what I'm saying? Oh, okay. <laughs> We're going to try it. Why not, right? You want me to sit right here where I am? Um, yeah, you can. It's fine. All right. Let me, let me get these, uh, if I get these last two in here. Oh, I think that, is that one, uh, is it? It might be a, uh... Alright, so when you auto-load, where does it throw them? Um, let's see. It should plop them right down beside you. Alright, so, let me, let me pull in there right where you're at. Okay. And then you pull off to, uh, right beside me. And let's see if this actually works. It actually should. So, I'm gonna actually auto-load. And it should land in your trailer. <laughs> yeah, there we go. That works. It's not pretty, but hey, it works. Yeah, go ahead and scoot up just a little bit. There, whoop, there you go. I was trying to get those other ones to fall down. That's all good. I tell you what, go dump these trees. All right, that's it. Yep. Yeah, what's up, Farmer Logger? There's a big oh, shout out to oh, you, bud. You need to pull, pull away. There you go. We're we're all good. There we go. I'll grab <laughs> this. I'll grab this last one and uh, oh, let me put some muscle mode on. <laughs> there we go. 
Make sure we get that uh, get that all up in there so we don't have any issues with it. There we go. And... Oh. Alright, you good on yours? Alright. Yep. Alright, if you want to, is Ryan, is he already down there? There, he's got, uh, and there he is. Oh, he's taking a break. He's drinking a Starbucks. <laughs> hey, it's, uh, it's okay, man. I, I'm not big enough, you know, um, I'm not big enough to get aggravated with the shout outs. You know, I'll give you one, and then after that, you know, if you keep asking for them, then, you know, that's, that's all of that. But it's all good. It's all good. We'll have a little bit of fun. As long as you don't make it every single stream, you know, we're, we're good to go. Traffic's already crazy. I guarantee it is, man. It usually starts on Thursday or Friday, and it'll go till it'll go till Monday, and then it'll be done. Maybe Tuesday, since the fourth actually falls on a Tuesday, but uh, that'll be interesting. I can't stand it though, and uh, especially anything interstate-wise. Gas prices go up. Everything goes up. Food. We have hamburgers and hot dogs, man. Those things get expensive around the fourth. You got some logs down here. Yeah, man. I got some logs. Where do you want me to put these junk ones? Um, I'll tell you what. Let's go over here and let's put them. Um, follow me. Let's go over here and put them somewhere over here. Because this will set up a chip. Yeah, which, we'll set a chipper joint up over here. Uh, and then we'll just kind of let it roll from there. Yeah, that, that'll be fine. At least we at least we know how we can uh, how we can actually get those to work together, so that's cool. All right, so while those guys are kind of finishing cleaning up, I'm gonna actually jump over here into a truck. Uh, but just to give you an idea, we got our wood stacks over here, and all these little sellable points right here are gonna be areas that we can actually take and deliver uh, certain stuff in here. Um, so we've got all of our log here to keep us going into the actual uh, lake. As you can see behind here, it drops off quite steeply. Um, Makes for a good uh, a good ramp anyway if we use the tilt deck, uh, <laughs> which we've done a few times. But anyway, we've got our uh, just our standard here, our high zoom mat. Uh, this is where our wood chips go. We could sell those, make fuel, heat, whatever. Uh, and then we've got a lot of these racks. Now here we've got two of these. These are you guys have seen me use these, but these are our plywood uh, production facilities. So we're producing uh, wood chips go into there, and then those are actually pressed into a press board, and we get plywood out of that. Uh, if you ever built or done anything with housing, that's where you go. We've got a couple of shops here. These things are full. We've got the F-350 flatbed there with the tilt deck trailer. We've got our 3500 Chevy Silverados uh, with a couple of uh, tri-axles there with our JCBs loaded up. So we've got our logs and we've got our stump grinders on the front there. And a nice Mercedes-Benz tractor here with a nice winch mod. This was in uh, part of the FS contest. This thing is actually awesome. So hopefully we can actually get to use this. And we've got us a couple of other things. Clamshell loader and we've got our regular grapple saw loader here from FDR. Both of these we can use, uh, especially around here, stacking things as we kind of see. Uh, now, kind of rolling here on the outside, we got our sawmill here. Logs go in here. On the other side, chips go in the other side. And these guys come out and produce nice lumber like this. And they're all stacked in two pallets. And part of those pallets will get taken over by our Clark forklifts. And those forklifts will go in over here. Now, and say, well, why wouldn't you take those directly out? Because once lumber is actually sawn, it has to be stickered and taped and then actually goes into a drying facility to dry. And there's airflow comes in and that stuff is actually has to dry for at least and it gets like a three months per every inch of, uh, of growth. So those actually will go in here. We'll actually be able to stack those up too high and those will be able to go all the way around the facility here. Suppress so board uh, and lumber can go up in here and store and dry and then we'll be able to use those take those up to our uh, housing uh, places up there, or at least our, our plots, and we'll be able to put those up there. Uh, we've also got a fuel facility back around here, so we've got all our diesels back there. Got us another extra mod here. It's a nice good forklift here, uh, and then we've got some more lumber that's sitting out here drying. We've actually got lights in the whole entire facility, so this whole entire thing lights up here at night, and it is absolutely gorgeous. I love it, if I say so myself. We also have a couple of places that we can sell. And uh, really the last thing you guys kind of saw here is we got, we've got us a nice barn here all complete with gutter system and everything. We've got all, all our auto loads here. We've got our low loaders. And we've got a couple of nice new tractors, flatbeds, so we can actually carry all of that up there. A nice good tipper trailer here bed for 
all of our wood chip production we can actually take those in it's all complete front and rear wheel drive these things are actually awesome to see so we've actually got those and plenty of pressure washers here to keep everything clean more lumber here uh, and then we've got a couple of the last couple of things here on the map uh, that we have right now is a couple of these the reduced fars they're actually the four tracked quad tracked versions and uh, i forget what they call this thing it's the piston bully but uh it was just cool so i wanted to put it in the map i have no idea what i'm gonna do with it but it's just cool and then we've got the beast wood chipper here this thing is absolutely fantastic really quick wood chip production and we've got the huge i don't even know how to say it. this is big old big old fdr i think they call this the laterno something of that nature this thing is slow as christmas but it'll grab a whole trailer load of logs in one big snap so we'll be using this thing uh and it is uh it is impressive so we get that uh and then this thing will actually go all the way up and uh, it's even got a thing where it pushes those logs out once you've done it so uh this thing is impressive so i can't wait to showcase that and see it working here on the map probably a little overkill for this yeah it's pretty pretty overkill but that's okay because this is the game and the games are supposed to be fun and we've got to finish off here with our d6 dozer we also got a d7 um <clears throat> but we've only got the d6 on so this will actually help us just kind of keep the wood chips in production here everything kind of cleaned up keep it out of the way uh we'll actually run everything off of conveyor belts so we'll pull the conveyor belts over here dump and allow those wood chips to just kind of flow into their own pile and as we need those wood chips here for the production of the press board as well as sawmill or if we just want to take those and actually sell those for make fuel out of them uh, we can certainly do that so uh, let's do a little quick trip here as we get going i'll catch up with chat there <laughs> pulled an ftg <laughs> nice man all right so uh let's see we'll pull some names up here so what we got uh ryan's in the white one chuck's in the black one and i'll let me just grab i'll grab the uh i'll grab the flatbed here all right here we roll off so um <clears throat> pretty much all this has been leveled out here for the map you guys have kind of seen what the right looks like so let's take a dip left uh we'll we'll stay out of uh out of two there how about that guys uh, we'll stay out of there and we'll uh, let's just go ahead go straight on up to nine and then we'll look on up to ten and we'll we'll showcase that and that should uh that should pretty much take our time up for today so All right, so this was an area we actually pulled this up. Um, I didn't pull the water plane up with it, so that's why I still get the warning. We're not going to drown or anything, but uh, this was all pretty much all kind of mud stuck off down into the area. So we actually uh, pulled all that up terrain-wise. Uh, so that was nice. Uh, we've got a home site there. Number six is actually uh, is, is going to be doable over there. So that's one that we will be able to do in the future. So let's hang us a uh, left here, boys, and let's go on over here. We'll check out eight and uh, nine and then we'll buzz on up there to ten so i've got gates set up to all these because eventually these will be private citizen homes and they want to keep the riffraff out so i guess they've paid enough money for their uh, plots of land up here on the side of the mountain so that's what they want so we got a nice uh, house here that's going up here that uh, guys make their summer homes and uh, we've got a couple of other ones here on the end uh, that we'll be pulling in as well. So we just got a big old rain here. As you can see, the flood, the waters are a little up. Not really. I just haven't raised the water plane. <laughs> uh, was that Wesley? Uh, stream tomorrow? I, I will be streaming with, I think, the Rat Pack tomorrow. Um, but I, I, will not, I don't know that I'll single be, be streaming myself. Uh, so we got another cabin over here that's being built. So this will be the same idea. Um, so we'll have uh, you know a nice gate there at the front of the driveway once we're all done, and we'll basically clear off this whole front. So we'll take the uh, we'll take the ravine side here to the ravine side on the other, and basically on their front porch this will be their view. So uh, it's going to be great. It's going to be lovely. Uh, almost going to make me want to crack open a top on a beer there, grab uh, some French fries from Wendy's, uh, and uh, yeah, and have a nice little meal there right on the front porch, man. I said french fries and winnies. I don't know why. I mean, I'd really much rather have a grilled steak or a burger or something. I don't know. Yeah, their burgers aren't too bad. I don't know why I said french fries. I have no idea. 
<laughs> the french fries are just really salty. Yep. Red Ranger, what's up, man? All right, so we'll make us a left here. Now this will be uh, another little gate here. Um, pretty much the whole entire map looks like this right here. This kind of a dirty gravel look. Uh, it's pretty much how the whole entire map uh, looks once you download it. So putting in all the cement, all the uh, the nice driveways and stuff uh, is a nice touch. So actually, as we cruise here, I'm going to kind of slowly pan. If you'll look up here to your 2, 3 o'clock, they're coming into the view. You will see our houses that we built up there. This was uh, off of our first episode, but since we'd already logged that, we went ahead and uh, the contracting guys came up here and they put a couple of houses up there on the side of that mountain. So we're just going to take a trip over there going to take a trip and uh, see what the view is like up there it is absolutely beautiful we did the old rickety wood bridge here got a brand new bridge stuck out concrete guys came in they graded the whole entire facility up here got it all nice and flat got power lines run everything is uh, pristine condition uh, ready for the new owners all we got to do now is come up here and plant a few decorative trees uh, and a little bit of landscaping, maybe cut the grass, and uh, we will be good to go. So we got two brand new uh, dual-style uh, villas up here, all wood construction. Uh, and that was built uh, out of the wood here of Emerald Valley. So uh, here is the nice view that those guys get. Uh, kind of awesome. Kind of awesome. Got to say I'm a little bit jealous of it. Not really, it's because it's a video game. But hey, we are having fun, and I like having fun on video games. So, um <laughs> you know, no, yeah, no, Red Ranger. Just go back uh, in the video, man. I've got a couple of explanations on that of where this map came from. This is actually my own mod map. So uh, this is all really goes to the Full Tilt Sawmill. So the only way you're going to see this kind of stuff and see this is to uh, subscribe here to the channel uh, FT, uh, with FTG or Full Tilt Gaming. Don't forget here, guys, you can uh, hit us up there, Full Tilt, on Twitter. Uh, as Chuck goes climbing there the rocks, he's going to go find another place. Chuck, why don't you go up there, drive up there, and actually see if we can put a home site up there. I would like to see y'all try to get the ergo up there all right i'll see what i can do over here but but don't that go would, don't go too steep because i don't have insurance on you guys yet so oh, don't worry if you guys fall then <laughs> uh, i'm gonna have to pull someone else out of stream to come help me wow that I, that thing is scaling the side of a mountain like for real <laughs> we could put a house on the very very top up there so uh, that's awesome that's awesome yes i do too benson I, the mountains man make this map if you just took these mountains out of the way this would be like a meh it's kind of a bland map but dude i love it that's what i mean every single home site here is going to have wonderful views so guys if you want to see this uh stay here with full till uh gaming don't forget sub to the channel don't forget find me there on facebook and full tilt uh you could tweet me there on twitter uh as well so I hope you guys have enjoyed it special thanks to chuck as he's crawling up the mountain there out of view uh special thanks to you bud and always special thanks to you ryan uh, appreciate it guys yeah, it was a lot of fun tonight it'll be fun to get the series going Yes, certainly will. Oh my God! Oh my God! Oh, my... <sighs> landed it. Well, oh we got <laughs> we got it all on video. <laughs> <laughs> That's awesome. That's awesome. Well, that was good. Good fun at the end of the stream, guys. So anyway, I hope you guys uh, have enjoyed this. Uh, you got questions? Like I said, guys, please let me know. Uh, let me know those comments if you want to know mods. Like I said, if you want anything. Uh, that you see here i can at least direct you to where to get them i can share links i can do all that i don't mind doing all that and sharing uh what i have here so that's what it's all about it's making uh making this a little bit better than what it is and what uh, just doing my part to pitch in so that's what ftgs united is all about so uh be looking here this week guys we'll try to catch up another ats or an ets stream and i'm going to try to do an unboxing of my steering wheel of my shifters and just everything that i've got kind of coming in that i'm trying to invest in for the better of the channel uh, I'll do that stuff as much as I can, trying to do some videos on it. So I hope you guys will check that out. Maybe we'll stream something here coming up, a little setup video, trying to get some things up and rolling. Uh, but other than that, guys, appreciate it. Thanks, Chuck and Ryan, again. Uh, thanks, Rap, and uh, you guys. Benson, nice and good to see you, buddy. Michael E., two of, my, two of my most favorite mods here. You guys always do a great job. And i got to say Chuck, and, uh, I say Chuck and, and Ryan, but they weren't modding. They were actually playing tonight. So 
uh, special thanks to all you guys. Uh, it has uh, been fun as always. But uh, until next time, be looking Friday or Saturday. We're going to start the uh, the new full till sawmill, uh, and we'll have a new episode up, and we'll be actually finishing up, cleaning up, and doing a lot of production next time. So uh, come around, hang around for that one. It's going to be good. So guys, we will see you here in uh, a couple of days, hopefully. Uh, but if not, we'll see you here at the end of the week. So it's been real as always, and guys, it's been real fun, and we'll see you next time.